All right, Dutchie, uh, in general, how's the week of training been? Yeah, it's been good. Uh, we've obviously had a big break between games. We played Friday and then following Sunday, so we have that nine-day turnaround. Able to get over a few bumps and bruises, so um, that was good, being able to reflect on the game and, and obviously build for this one. So uh, good preparation. You had a few guys earlier in the week that were, I guess, being eased, you know, like the tags, for example. Like, how are those guys? Yeah, no tag strain today, no problem. Um, Q uh, still had a session off his off his feet today. Had a fairly difficult one the other day, but he'll uh, he'll train tomorrow. He should be fine. So um, apart from the ones that were already injured, uh, everyone's fine. Fit. Have you been happy with the response, considering um, the, I guess how they could have been a bit down after the first game? Yeah. Look, you know the, the boys were very much up for the game and disappointed with the way it panned, uh, panned out. But uh, looking forward to being at home for the first game and, and looking to make uh, Energy Australia really into a fortress this year. You talked about, uh, I guess, working on the front third. Um, have you made any personnel changes and anything like that for this week? Yeah, look, we've made a, 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 um, a slight change in the way that we've, we've sort of set up a little bit. But uh, it was more so about um, just the, the positivity in that front third, you know. And, and it doesn't matter if we're talking about, you know, the two wide players or, you know, the, the nine or the ten. It's about anyone who gets into that into that final third, whether it's from a set piece, whether it's from fullbacks overlapping, whatever it might be. We just need to have more energy and more more uh, aggression in in that area, and uh, we've definitely um, uh, looked to resolve that for this weekend. Have you like confirmed Bridgie comes in and, and Nathan shuffles out to the to the right or anything like that? Yeah, look, we we train today and we we, we train a couple of ways, but uh, you know we're pretty pretty well set on on what we're going to do. Um, in the back line, uh, were you comfortable with the guys from uh, from last week with the back line? I guess, you know, Perth, a, a few big names up front for them, so you're comfortable with that back line from last yeah, week? Yeah, no, I thought from uh, from our defensive shape, I mean, the two goals came from two errors from ourselves. Um, but uh, overall, uh, with and without the ball, I thought the defensively we were good. Um, I thought uh, the, uh, the, the the back line bringing the ball into, into the midfield was, was good. Uh, I thought... Um, uh, the wide players getting up and down were, was was very positive as well. So, um, and, and even from a, a defensive point of view, were, were very hard to break down. So, from that from that, they were um, obviously able to do what what we set out to do. But uh, again, um, it's it's not just about the the back four. It's about you know from the front that we we, we start to defend, and from from the back we start to attack. So, uh, but again, they, they were good in their area. Zanon had a pretty tough night. How's his response been this week? Yeah, look, he was uh, he was he was obviously very upset after the game, and you know we've um, to, to the point that he wanted to apologise to the team. And, 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 and look, you know, he, he didn't need to do that. It was great that he took ownership, but uh, you know we're all in it together, and he's trained very very well for this week, and he can't wait to play at home and, and you know first home game. How do you think Perth will travel? They had a obviously an incredibly tough first uh, first game against Adelaide. Yeah, look, I think they'll. Uh, um, not make too many changes. I think at the moment, I think all teams are a little bit like that. Uh, we'll wait, you know, four or five rounds before people start to settle down. But uh, you know, I, I, I'd envisage they wouldn't make too many changes.